how to simplify logarithms without using a calculator by using the quotient property. All right, so the first thing we need to do is rearrange the logs that we're given in this expression according to the quotient property. All right now, you don't always have to do it, but sometimes it does make it easier, or a lot easier. All right, so what the quotient property says is if you have two logs with the same base and you subtract them, okay, what you can do is you can combine them and then divide the two values of the logs. So basically that means instead of doing this minus this, you can just divide these two guys right here, the two values of the logs. Okay, so that gives me this, the log with base 4 is of 256 here. And then we need to evaluate. So what I'm going to do first is I'm going to just look at the values and then I'll convert it to exponent form. So the log value is 256, the base is 4, and then, as you know, we are looking for the exponent. Okay, so an exponent form, it looks like this. All right, so the base is 4, we don't know what this is, and then we have 256 as the answer. Okay, some people can do that in their heads right away. All right, I'm going to write this out. Okay, so 4 to the something is 256. Okay, all right, it's not 4 squared, right, that would be 16. It's not 4 to the third, and right, that'd be 64, but 64 times 4 is 256. Okay? So the answer is 4. All right, and that completes our problem.